As a diabetic, Bonnie Grunke has had her share of infections over the years. The one that hit her in September 2020, however, would require more than medical science to heal. I woke my husband up and I says, I think I really need to go to the hospital. I mean, I could not stop trembling. I never had chills like this before in my life. It was terrible. In the emergency room, doctors discovered an abscess on her kidney, causing severe kidney infection. It covered 90% of my kidney. When I met the doctor and he says, it was a good thing I came in when I did, because if I had waited much longer, I could have died. Bonnie was admitted and doctors gave her antibiotics to treat the infection and inserted a pick line to drain the fluid from the abscess. When the one pick line couldn't keep up, doctors added another. The second one was so painful, I cried and I said, please, Lord, stop this pain, just stop the pain. I mean, I was in terrible, terrible pain. Over the next several weeks, Bonnie would be in and out of the hospital. Every time doctors thought they had taken care of one infection, another would take its place. And I didn't just have one bacteria in there. I had several. The doctor told me he had never seen any, any type of infection like what I had. The pick lines having failed, doctors took Bonnie into surgery to insert a stent to help drain the fluids. Still, the infection raged on, and Bonnie began losing hope. The house is a total disaster. I lived in the bedroom for three months. That was probably my low point. I felt hopeless and helpless. I was frightened. I really didn't want to die yet. Through it all, Bonnie turned to God for help and healing. I would pray to the Lord, and I would say, please, Lord, guide me, get me out of this. But I also, I would end with, thy will be done. If it's my time, I'm yours. It's not what I want, but what he wants. I wanted to be healed. Then on December 2nd, 2020, Bonnie was watching the 700 Club when Pat and Wendy started praying for the audience. Somebody has a severe kidney infection. It's really, it's, use the term nephritis, it's really serious. And God, right now, you'll feel power in the, in the small of your back and you'll feel heat and you are healed in the name of Jesus. Oh my goodness, that's me. I am claiming this. I hollered to my husband, Martin, I says, "Hun." And I told him what Pat Robertson said. And that, that morning, it was still all that nasty drainage coming out. It didn't drain for a while. And then all of a sudden, when it started draining, it was totally clear. I knew I was healed. Also gone was the pain. A month later at a follow-up appointment, Bonnie's doctor confirmed the infection and abscess was gone and removed the drainage tubes and stints from her kidney. The healing of my kidney has strengthened my faith. I knew there was no infection. I knew I was healed, and that brought my spirits up 110%. The Lord gives me my strength. Sometimes you may not even feel him, but know he is there and he is carrying you.